I got you. I can go get that butt. Good morning, girls. Good morning. Oh, little feet. Your little feet. Rosie. Lily. Rosie, stop chewing on your butt. Stop chewing on your butt, Rosie. <sighs> Miss Rosie Roo. Come here, Lily. <laughs> oh. This is the cuddle time in the morning. Cuddles in the morning. Okay, time to get coffee and get started. What do you think? I think so. Hi, YouTubers. RV Debs here. Good morning, friends, family. Um, I'm on my way to get my nails filled in, redone, or whatever you want to call it. So I thought I would take y'all along. I don't have any idea what color I want to pick. I wanted to do burgundy, but he tells me he's out of the powder for burgundy every time I ask. Ugh. He doesn't seem to want to reorder either. Okay. I have a noon appointment and it is 1130. That should be perfect. Hi, Joe. Just waved at me. Our neighbor. Okay, we're off. It is going to be really hot. It doesn't feel too hot right now. Um, I think it's like 90, but it doesn't feel it to me. Maybe 87. It's supposed to get up to 95. Maybe even 99, but... It's kind of overcast. I don't know. I hope it doesn't get that hot. And the humidity is very low. Which does make it more tolerable. If it rained really hard, like, you know, and then the next day it's, you know, 100 degrees, then the humidity is high. But we haven't had any rain in a, a few weeks, a couple of weeks at least, maybe more. So that makes, that makes it more comfortable, low humidity. I had a really great live stream yesterday. It was so much fun. I enjoy getting to speak to, you know, to you guys who join me in the live stream. I get to know you, we, we get to interact, you know, to, to uh, have some interactions with each other. Which is good, because usually, like now, I'm just talking to my camera, which I know I'm talking to you. That's for sure. But it's different when the people are right there answering me or giving me their, you know, their thoughts or their um, life stories or whatever we're talking about. So I really want to thank you guys for joining in and, you know, being there to, uh, to just keep me company. Because live stream is like having friends over. And there's times when I really feel like having conversations and friends around me. And there's not that many people around me. So it's, it helps. It helps me a lot. Well, today um, is time for me to go get my nails changed. I'm so tired of this color. And that's about it, really. I mean, you know, I'm going to go to the grocery store, too, while I'm out. 
So I will talk to you guys in a little while. Talk to you soon. Okay. Heading to Haskell. Haskell, Texas. But you can see it's an overcast kind of day, which really does help when it comes right down to it. When it's hot, I don't feel hot. But then again, I'm not outside. I'm grateful for my air conditioned truck. My lovely truck. This was my husband's truck. And you know, when he first got this truck, I was like, oh, I don't want a, I don't want a truck. I want, you know, a regular car. And uh, <laughs> now I'm so happy to have it. It's a comfy, comfy truck and it's roomy and yeah, it's good memories. It's getting older. It's got 115,000 miles, but it's a 2007, so that's actually low miles. Because um, 15 average is 15,000, 12 to 15,000 a year. Just got out of the nail appointment and I'm ready to go to the grocery store. So I thought I would share my nails with you guys. And they turned out to be, it's like a teal, kind of a dark teal blue. Looks pretty good, but it's pretty good. So anyway, got my toenails the same color. I'm all set. Let's go to the store and then go home. It's about, it says 101 degrees in the truck here but it's dry heat so it wasn't feeling too bad just just hot plain ordinary hot <laughs> on my way back home did my grocery shopping and man the avocados were really expensive 279 for each one I don't get it I know they're they were nice and big but sheesh highway robbery I love my avocados that's the one thing that I do enjoy in the morning with my toast. Ah, so here I am, all my nails done, shopping's done. Mark's busy putting the drawers in. I just talked to Kathy on the phone and she said, he's still working on it. <coughs> Excuse me. It's never as easy as you think, you know. But he said he's working on it. I'm sure he is. The dog spent the day at Kathy and Mark's house with Kathy. And uh, that's, you know, just another day. Another day in paradise. Because I'm living in a small town in Texas. 
where people smile and get to know your name. I never thought I'd ever want to live like this, but now I'm living in a small town in Texas. Yep, living in a small town in Texas. I should probably add a couple more verses to that. It was just raining a few drops. I'm hoping it rains more because that'll cool it down. Right now it's 95 in the car. And uh, it might be like 92, really. It's always a little warmer when you've been in the sun parked. But anyway, I'll be home in a little while. Hope you're all having a good day. I'll uh, turn the camera around for a minute and show you where I'm at and then talk to you later. for my nail appointment and Mark is working on the second drawer but that's the first drawer and then he's gonna you know be putting wood to block it all in right as you'll see and he's working hard and I'm sitting here watching uh, DPO family vlog dirt poor outdoor Nadia and Nathan's latest video so if you haven't subscribed to DPO family vlog this is this is my family my crazy great family there's tanny <laughs> anyway that's what i'm doing i'll keep you guys i'll keep showing you what you know when they're when this is going further and almost done and then when it's done oh, mark's just finished on the second drawer he's trying to fit in isn't that something though? Those are two beautiful big storage drawers. 10 by 20. 10 by 20. Not bad. Made by hand. By my personal friend and carpenter. It's always harder than you think though. It's always that way. Just with any with any task, you know, you're like, yeah, that'll be easy. No, nothing's easy. <laughs> That's true. Okay, I'm going to turn the video off, but I'll show you in the very end when it's completely done. But I am very, very, very happy with it. It's going to be so nice to put all that stuff away that, you know, just to, like, lighten up other areas. Yes, yes, thank you, thank you, Mark. Well, we got almost done. Tomorrow he's going to fix the, uh, this here with, like he did the one over there. I now have two drawers. He's not a carpenter, you know, cabinet maker. So, you know, he did as best as he could. He really did struggle with it. But it's still going to work for me, and I'm happy with that. So, I appreciate it. Well, you know, he, he worked for way too long. Because it's not easy. Not easy to put drawers I'm in. I'm sitting here watching The Bachelorette. The finale. I finished a painting today. And I'm just, I just glazed it with my uh, varnish and this is it and it's on a I guess it's a half inch canvas totally finished and it took me all day my camera just turned off but anyway it took me from like around I guess noon time till about seven I mean, I was done before that. I let it dry and then I varnished it. But anyway, what do you think? I hope you think it's as pretty as I want it to look. She's laying on a very shallow area on the beach or whatever that is. <laughs> and that's it. That's my latest painting. It's 8 by 10. I'm going to list it. I'm taking some, I got to take pictures and then I'll list it on Etsy. But by the time you see the video, it will be on Etsy. And I still have, oh, I have two new drawers over there anyway. And two paintings here. 
My drawers are really cute. Oh, let me let me show you. Hold on, I'll pause it. You can't see both drawers because Lily and this uh, this thing here is in front of one drawer, but it's definitely nice. Two big drawers, and I already got stuff in them. Yeah, I've been busy, and Mark's been busy, and now it's it's all done. Anyway, I am going to uh, take some photos and stick it up on Etsy, and I hope somebody out there loves my mermaid, because I haven't done a mermaid in years. Yeah, so this is the latest one. Talk to you guys later on. I hope you enjoyed this video. It's not a huge video of, with a lot of content, just life in Knox City, Texas.